Hey there everyone, Paradise Gamer 13 here, and I'm uh, playing the Pokemon trading card game, the Game Boy Color once again, and this time, as you might be able to tell, I am in the Psychic Club, and I just uh, made probably the largest amount of changes to my deck um, that I have for any club. Um, not only did I obviously change the Pokemon and energies around, but I also um, changed around quite a few of the tra uh, trainer cards. I have less defenders and um, I forget what else I took out. Some other miscellaneous ones, I think maybe. Like maybe like a Bill or a Professor Oak, Oak or something like that. And I put in a lot of um, item finders and recycles um, to kind of fish uh, other cards out of my discard pile. And. Hopefully that'll be a good idea because that way I can potentially get a lot of Ghastlies back into the mix. Because those will probably die kind of quickly since they can't really attack. Well, I have two that can attack and uh, or that can actually do damage, I guess I should say. And two that can only put, uh, possibly put my opponent to sleep and use Destiny Bond. Which isn't horrible, but, you know, they're kind of vulnerable basically until I get Haunter and Gengar. And even Haunter isn't overly... Uh, reliable either, but I should probably stop rambling and actually get started with something here. People who use psychic, yes, psych, psychic Pokemon are difficult to use, but they're very strong. Okay. What? You also want the legendary Pokemon cards? I want them too, but I'm not, still not quite. Okay. Alright, let's just go ahead and get started in here, I guess. Um, looks like there's only either, there's only either two trainers in here, or maybe there's one in that lobby area, but, uh, you've won quite a few medals. Okay, let's do but I see the future, you will lose. Huh. Yeah, let's try it anyways. Um, kind of a shady figure here. Strange power deck. Let's see what I can do. I'll probably talk... I'm sure there's other things about my deck that I changed that I forgot to mention, but I'm sure we'll see here. Mostly Abra, Abras and Kadabras and Ghastly Haunter Gengar. So I'm going to go ahead and start off. Abra is unfortunately weak to... Oh, I, I did put in... Uh, Taros and Snorlax, so I got two colors uh, Pokemon thrown in there as well, uh, for good measure. Because, like I said, Snorlax you can take up a ton of hits and stall me a lot of time, and Taros can probably even stall me some time as well. He doesn't have quite as high health, obviously, but um, he has some pretty decent attacks. I can hopefully take a couple Pokemon down with him. So, let's see here. I'm not sure if I want to start with Ghastly or Abra. Um... I'm actually going to go ahead and start with Gasly, because that's mainly who I built my deck around. Um, the only thing is, obviously, if uh, she starts off with a Psychic type, then and I don't go first, then Abra will be in kind of a bit of trouble, because it will be super effective against me, as well as against her. My attacks will be against her, most likely, assuming she uses a Psychic type. And obviously, that's not always the case with some of these trainers, as I've seen with the, the Fighting Club and the Fire Club, even. And I got the Item Finder. Oh, what? Oh, Mr. Mime. I couldn't tell what card it was for a minute. It looked kind of obscure, but what's this do? Does 30 or more damage prevent... Whoa, that's... That's a problem. Hmm. That's really good. Um... Interesting. 10 damage plus 10 more damage for each damage counter on the defending Pokemon. Okay, I need to knock this guy up pretty quickly. Thankfully, I can do that in two turns. And my attack only does 10, so we're good to go here, hopefully. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use Psychic Energy on Ghastly. And let me just check my hand again. I have 5 Energy Removal, Gust of Wind, press the hook. Okay. Go ahead and attack the Lick. Nope. And that's not a huge problem because I think he won't actually be able to attack anyways um, next turn. I think he might need two energies for uh, Meditate. So, and even if he did... Oh, wow, this guy's actually a little bit more... Uh, um, uh, oh, shoot, it's another Mr. Mine. <laughs> um, not that it's a huge deal for me because I can take... Yeah, she, she must have only had one Pokemon on the, uh, the bench. Okay, that kind of annoys me. But it's not like a big deal because I don't. I, I this Ghastly is serving me quite well. I actually don't really want to evolve him yet 
because these Mr. Mimes will um, otherwise give me a lot of problems <laughs> because my Gengar would not be able to attack him except for his Pokemon power and the bench damaging move that he has. Yeah, this Gastly has 50 HP. That's kind of nice. I think the other one I have only has like 30 or 40 maybe, so that's kind of what I was thinking of uh, initially when I was talking about them earlier. But yeah, okay, so he takes two energies to attack. So likewise, I can knock out that one, um, Mr. Mime. Yeah, so she only had one bitch Pokemon. And unfortunately, obviously, that's just kind of the, the way things have been so far. Uh, paralysis will not matter here, although of course I get it. Um, but you know, these all the trainer matches seem to go by in just like a few minutes, and then the uh, the master battles are decidedly a little more closer. Of course, there's more prize cards too. I guess I should mention. Also, I have like two water energies in here in case my double colorless energies aren't enough to fuel Snorlax and uh, Taros. But I didn't throw in too many extra like other energies because ga the the Ghastly Line and the Abra Line. Oh, I got a Super Potion as well, so that's nice. Um, both of them uh, only take Psychic Energies for their attacks, so yeah. Um, I don't really want to use anything else. I'm pretty good with Lick, I guess, because I could win here pretty shortly. I don't think he... He does have one energy, but even if uh, she attaches another one to him, he won't be able to attack due to paralysis unless she has a full heal. So, I may have won the game unless she draws an revenge Pokemon here. That's pointless. Yep, okay, so I won. <laughs> um, again, a short match, so... I don't really know what to say about that. Like I said, um, I could use Recycle. I'm actually just gonna go ahead and use it just for kicks. Um, I just kind of show it off. Of course, I don't get heads. So that didn't really work out favorably as I had hoped. But I believe it's any card from your discard pile that you get to recycle. So that would be nice. Of course, I get heads again. I always get heads when it doesn't matter. But oh well. That's not a huge problem because I won. So there's a psychic energy. Also, the nice thing too, I guess, is about uh, the less prize cards you have, the less, or the more cards that I may potentially actually need, I will actually still have in my deck. So that's a thing too. Uh, yeah, I don't know where I was going with that. Never mind. I'll just drop what I was talking about and move on here. I can't believe my prediction was wrong. All right. Well, I get some more uh, laboratory booster packs. Looks like Cluffable. Is that the one I already have? I think it. Yeah, it is. Uh, Wheezing, Ghastly. Slowbro, Magnemite, Onyx, Recycle, Tentacool. Um, oh yeah, I think I already have that one. Gambler, Slowpoke, and that's it. Magneton, do I already have this one? I don't remember a Silt Struck doing 100 though. Yeah, no, what? Wait, that's a lot different than the, or maybe not a lot, but I thought it would have done I thought it did 80 for some reason. I don't remember it doing 100. Um, yeah, because it does 100 damage to itself, but it only has 80 HP. That's kind of weird. I have maintenance. I don't even remember what it does. Though. Shuffle two of the air cards in your hand in order to... Yeah. I mean, it's not a horrible card, but I mean, it's just one that I haven't had any use for recently. Because I think I already have one, one or two, maybe. Um, Marowak. That's not Marowak. That's Magmar. <laughs> I was like, wait... Um, smoke screen, smog. It's okay. Um, yeah, he's not horrible. He, his attacks don't do much, but he has, you know, secondary effects. That's not too bad. Marowak, Zubat, Tentacool, Daduo, Slowpoke, Horsey, Poliwag. I see a vision. You're dueling me again. Well, not right now, because I'm going to move on with the next trainer in the next video. So. As always, I hope you guys liked this video, and if you did, I would really appreciate you leaving me a like and potentially subscribing to my channel if you haven't done so and you want to get notified of future content and videos and stuff. And as always, I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks again for watching.